In this video, I'm overclocking the Intel graphics for Arrow Lake desktop CPUs all the way up to 3.1 gigahertz in five minutes or less. I'll speed run you through the BIOS settings and provide some notes and tips along the way. Please don't copy these settings and apply them to your system. If you want to learn how to overclock the Intel graphics for Arrow Lake, have a look at the longer Scatterbencher video that's already up on this channel. All right, let's do this. When you've entered the BIOS, go to the Extreme Tweaker menu. Set Performance Preferences to Asus Advanced OC Profile. This sets a number of BIOS options that help with overclocking, including some that override Intel's default parameters. Set AI Overclock Tuner to XMP1. This lets us rely on the Intel Extreme Memory Profile 3.0 technology and will make our memory run at its rated speed of DDR5-8000. Selecting XMP1 means the motherboard will load the XMP profile's primary timings, frequency, and voltage. However, we let the motherboard tune the secondary timings. Set ASUS Multicore Enhancement to Enabled Remove All Limits. This unleashes the Turbo Boost 2.0 power limits and lets the CPU run at unlimited power indefinitely. Set Max CPU Graphics Ratio to 62. That increases the GPU frequency to 3100 MHz because the 100 MHz reference clock is first divided by 2 and then multiplied by the graphics ratio. Set NGU ratio to 34. That increases the NGU frequency by 800 MHz from the default 2.6 GHz. Set CPU graphics voltage to manual mode. That switches the VCC GT voltage rail configuration mode from the standard dynamic SVID to the static PM bus, which helps us avoid some of the performance throttling problems SVID mode introduces. Set CPU graphics voltage override to 1.3. Set CPU system agent voltage to manual mode. This dynamic voltage rail powers several parts of the SOC dialid, including the NGU, IMC, and NPU. By setting it to manual mode, we can set a static output voltage from the voltage regulator. Set CPU system agent voltage override to 1.3, then save and exit the BIOS. We rerun some benchmarks to ensure everything works as intended and check the performance increase compared to the default settings. Higher is better and all of our benchmark scores are higher. The highest graphics clock reported in the operating system is 3100 MHz. When running the 3 Mark Speedway Stability Test, the average GPU clock is 3100 MHz with 1.249 volts. The GPU memory clock is 4000 MHz. The average GPU temperature is 39 degrees Celsius, and the average GPU core's power is 18.8 watts. And that's it. I thank you for watching, the YouTube members and the patrons for their support, and see you next time.